How to map a network drive in Windows 7. To map a network drive, click the Start button, go to Computer, and from this screen, from the computer screen, you'll see a button that says Map Network Drive. Click that, select the letter, and then you'll key in the server address followed by the share. You'll notice there's an example, backslash, backslash, server, backslash, share. So just key it in. So in my case, my server address, it doesn't have a, a server name, it's just an IP address, backslash, backslash, 10.0.0.20, backslash, photo. It's to a network attached storage NAS drive I have. And then I click Finish, and then it maps. And so now you'll see a new network location, the photo share on 10.0.0.20. Alternatively, if you didn't want to map it to a network drive, but you wanted to create a shortcut to the same location, you'll right click, new, and select shortcut. It asks you for the location of the item. So the location is that same address, 10. 0.0.20 backslash photo and then click next and it asks you to give it a name you can name it anything you want I'll call it photos and I'm clicking finish and now you'll notice I have this shortcut to a network location this is not the same as mapping the network drive but it's a way to get to a network resource but here it's mapped to the L drive and you'll be able to access this in situations where you need a drive letter mapping. Another way also you may find helpful is from within Excel or other Office 365 software you may need to map a drive. So if you're ever in Office 365 and need to map a drive you'll notice at the bottom it says tools. If you click that there's an option for map network drive and it takes you to the same dialog box that we had earlier where we could select the letter and then type in the file share. If this helps you, please click like or maybe leave a comment to let others know that this worked. If you have other techniques for mapping network drives, please leave those in the comments below for others. And if you'd like to subscribe, you could do that as well by clicking the subscribe button. Thank you for watching Technuba, Technuba.